Kaylee Coletta says she's thankful to be standing on two feet after she was told she could have lost them and potentially even her life. They said that there was a chance that if we didn't control it, that it could have went to my bloodstream. So I'm glad that it didn't. Kaylee went canoeing on the Little Miami River and had a scab on her foot. She says she bandaged it up properly to avoid infection, but a few days later she came down with a fever and her foot turned black. The doctor said if we had waited 24 more hours, she would not be here today. That's scary. It moves that quick. Kaylee's mom, Kathy, is glad they caught it early. Kaylee had three surgeries to get rid of the bacteria. She's a very lucky girl. Absolutely. Doctors say the bacteria gets in through the skin and can cause a lot of damage. It usually comes when you get in fresh water, and sometimes the germ may already be on your skin. They invade and they usually have toxins. Uh, and they cause a lot of damage locally. Dr. Carl Fitchbaum with UC Health told us it's important to act fast. Sometimes, uh, you know, the infection spreads so quickly that the muscle gets destroyed and there's no way to salvage a person's arm or leg. Fortunately for Kaylee, she'll have a full recovery. I'm just thankful that it worked and that I'm cured now. Doctors say if you think you contracted something while out on the water to quickly seek medical attention. In Warren County, I'm TJ Parker for the Now Cincinnati. Wow, doctors say if you want to go into fresh water with the